All right. Hey guys, what's up? Giku here. So today we have a Sino Alice video. I will be presenting to you 10 tips and tricks and one bonus one to help you get through the beginning part of the game and to help you save a lot of time, resources, and everything. This is going to help a lot. I've compiled this from all my research and also the help of Rezi on Discord in the official Sino Alice Discord. The Sino Alice Discord, there's two in the link in the description, you'll see them with the other discords that I take a part of with the videos. Alright, so at, for the beginning, is there a weapon tier list? Would you say some weapons are way better than others? Well, it's kind of hard to say with how many weapons there are in the game, it's really hard to say. But there are four, play, uh, four different things you should be using for PvE and PvP. For PvP, you would be using uh, DPS PvP, uh, Hammers and Spears since they have um, basically, um, they're not single target, they're multi-target. You want to do as much damage to as many people, right? For PvP buff debuff, you want to get multi-target harps books with support boost. For PvP heal, multi-target staves with heal boost. For PvE, swords or guns since they are single target. This is a quick little explanation we having an equipment guide and a job guide so do not worry on that now getting into the 10 tips that i've i have now tip number one you want so basically you're going to be getting these uh, medals whenever you summon so you want to use these medals the okay so there's a lot right now but you want to use these medals so these are our so basically let's load, load in it's gonna take a little second these are arcanas these basically let your job level get more things to maximize if you get an arcana it could go from job level max 10 to 11 12 then you could get it 13 14 so i think that makes sense right so i think you're able to get up to 14 right now now, uh, basically, there's tons of different ones. There's going to be some monthly ones. We have. I'm going to have to check on that which one it is. It probably is this one. If any, it would have to be this one since it is on the top. Or it would be another one. But it seems like it's this one. So you would want to focus on Arcanas, alright? So maybe you would uh, want to focus on one of the main units. Because, yeah. Now, you could get 300. But these Arcanas are super, super important. Great? All right, so when you basically, you're able to sell stuff. I think it's this one here. Okay, so uh, let me just find it real quick. It should be this one then. Okay, so selling stuff. If you, have, uh, if you don't have enough space, you would sell stuff, right? No, do not do that. Instead, what you will do, you go to enhance. Now, please note. It's going to be different on global. You're going to have the text in English. But I want to release this so that everyone is aware of these before the game releases. You used to have this green scythe. Well, if you put green, you see this on the bottom? The skill level is going up. This is going up because they're green, right? So your Colosseum and your PvE boost will be more effective. Alright? So you do not want to waste them. I wasted over a hundred of these. But if you add them, your skill level increases, you'll be doing more stuff. Perfect, right? And you also get a bit of XP with this. So honestly, that's perfect. Now, uh, so, all, so basically lock all your SS weapons and nightmares. Or on global, it would probably be SR. So nightmares. These things are nightmares. They boost your stats in uh, some way or another. This one boosts my wind equi uh, weapons. This one boosts fire weapons. So you do not want to sell those SR ones. And also equipment. You could end up selling your SR equipment. Do not, please. SR equipment, you could use as much as possible. Now, guilds. Guilds are a big part of PvP. Uh, sorry, a big part of the game. Now, basically... Guilds have a Colosseum mode. This Colosseum mode is very useful. I haven't been able to try it, but basically, you want to join a guild with a Colosseum time slot that lets you participate always or at least as often as possible. So, 
since it's once per day, only 20 minutes, you want to be there. The 15 on 15 will have to be good. Me and Ace will be hosting some uh, live um, test t tryouts for it, and uh, hopefully you join. If you guys have the same time slot, then uh, yeah. Basically, we're looking for people that could do it at the same time, and we need 13 members, so that's something. Now, these things are cleanse, so cl cleaning, cleansing, I don't know. You want to not abuse these. As you see, I have abused it. Now, they do give you XP, but only to a certain point. You want to only use it when you're near zero AP, right? So this is going to help you maximize the most on AP and let you grind the most, all right? Don't try to get ahead of level. You could take your time because once you hit that max level, you will only be able to do every eight hours. So to level up your jobs. So if you go here, you must get job points. I think it's this one. Yeah. So these things are job points. To level up your jobs, you need job points. So they're obtainable by um, using SP in battle, which you get 200 from the start. And that's what you use when using free nightmares not um, gotcha nightmares, free nightmares, or when using weapons. So, uh, the more SP you use, the more you'll get. And I would, and also, there's basically these books that and uh, grimoires that it's it's gonna say in your item list, the butterfly. It's going to say that it's gonna give you points. I claim mine that I got yesterday, but you will probably have one or two of those in your item box. Now, there isn't a specific job tier list. Um, use the one you want. For weapons, there isn't a huge difference also, but I don't think like I don't think people want to make a tier list. So all jobs, I have a I have a pretty good amount of jobs. So one, two, three, four. I think it would be this one. Yeah. I have a good amount of jobs. I decided to choose Snow White because I like her basically waifu of the game. Now, if there was someone else I liked, I could use her. It really doesn't matter. Just don't really use orb. All right, they're not too good. Just use who you want, really. If you want to go healer, supports are super, super great. Like, I would be grateful for one. We need supports in my guild. If you want to join, come. Ace is going to have a live stream probably on his channel. Join if you want. Now, choose whatever. I think it's either books or orbs that are useless. Uh, don't don't quote me on that. But, no. Go for the one you want. I went for uh, Snow White. One that I, a different job. Not one of the starters. But you're probably going to be starting with one of the OG starters. So, there's a better... So, you want to upgrade your equipment, or sorry, weapons, all same level. So, you want to get them 15, 15, 15, instead of a 60, 5, and 5. Because the higher you get a, a weapon, the more it's going to cost you. So, you want to level up all consistently, so it costs you the least amount. I think that, I think that makes sense. I mean... Personally, you shouldn't be like leveling up. I did that, so I'm 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 guilty there. Now, when you do co-op with friends or um, guildies, um, basically, you want to start doing it right away as soon as possible. You are going to get three friend medals per day when you do three co-op stages. Now, if you go over here, so this green coin is a friend medal. You are able to get one uh, one uh, metal for five twilight crystals. Or uh, yeah, twilight crystals. You get 15 per day. So in a month, it's a free. It's a free multi, right? Now that's not bad. You're getting a free multi just by doing get, like by doing stuff that gives you even more. Now you could get this stuff, but personally, don't get it. Like you just it would take too long. One, you get 300 in a month. Even more, because. You get you get 900 because you get three per day. That's 15 per day, times that by 30. 15 times, that would be no sorry. Uh, so 30. For 30. No, you get 450 per month. That is really good. It takes 300 to do a multi, right? Or on um, some special cases on JP, I don't know about global. It will take 500. So personally, that is very good. All right, so now I want to see if this works. Okay, so, oh, you're not able to see this. All right, let me see if I'm able to add this. All right, so I'm gonna have this in a separate clip. 
Now, uh, right now I probably took off the screen because it probably looked really bad right there. All right, so I'm gonna be showing you how to maximize your FPS. Uh, see you in two seconds, all right? See ya. All right, this is the last tip. So when you come here, now basically in this settings bar, you wanna go to settings. Now, you wanna click on engines. You're gonna scroll down just a bit. Now, basically this is how to get better frame rates and better quality. You want to put this up to so you want to enable high frame rates so i'm going to take this off just for now enable high frame rates now if you have a medium a decent computer go 144 all right so basically once 144 uh and let's head in game and see how good it is all right so now once in the game you want to head to settings so this is to get better quality. You want to head to settings, go here, basically the configure, and you want to head to the bottom. Now, this, you want to have, there's three, right? So, you want to put this one. Now then, let's say I'm here. Let's go here. You could see from a bit before, now it's loading, the quality dropped. Now, if you go back, you put this, you go out, the quality increases now then uh let's put go to my now you might not see this i don't know yeah you won't see this on your screen but i'm going to enable uh fps so you could see yeah you're able to see how much fps so i've got 60 right now with if i um take off enable high frame rates the fps should be going down at one point it's going so usually it runs at 60 but because i enabled it too it's gonna still run at uh, 60 right so now go out and uh, it's still running at 60 perfect now that's to, just to show you now this is of course just for blue stacks this tip is just for blue stacks but it's a tip that is definitely um worthy all right so thank you guys for watching the video really appreciate it hope this vid blows up i really do if you want to like and sub, that would be amazing. You could share the video. I will see you guys in the next time. See ya. Peace.